Hi guys. Um so y'all say anything different about me? I got my lips done. Um the process while healing and everything. Um that video will be up probably after this video so stay tuned subscribe for that video if you want to know my lip filler journey but um we're just gonna throw the hair to the back there we go um but what today's video is about is about how cosmetic procedures don't really change your situation um if that makes sense so I'm screaming, the mailman is literally watching me film this video right now. But anyways, um, literally, he's cute. He, he low-key cute with his little bun and bun back there. At least, yeah, he's kind of cute. Okay, anyway, um, so yeah, I just wanted to talk about like the truth about cosmetic procedures now that I, I have had one. So let's get into the video. Um... So I have been wanting my lips done for at least like six months, maybe a little over six months. I at least, I want to, before I do anything drastic to like my body or my face, it's something that I have to like be wanting for at least a certain amount of time. Um, so I was like, ooh, okay, actually over six months because I wanted to get my lips done last year, but I couldn't. Um, so I, yeah, I really wanted my lips done. And this year with, um, update, mini update, um, I got a new day job. Um, I really do enjoy it. I really, really do enjoy it. Um, so with my new day job and my new day job pay, um, I was like, hmm, I can save up to get my lips done. And that's what I did. So I did my little boop, 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 my little research. Um, I've been on the internet a very long time, people. I know how to, I know how to find stuff. Um, did my research, called, um, a couple places, um, and the place that I went to, shout out to Prime Aesthetics, okay, see, but, yeah, um, had, like, a consultation to see, like, how they do pricing, if they were gonna be able to do what I wanted, and I didn't want anything major, like, as you can see, I literally just wanted more of a top lip to match my bottom lip, and honestly, I want a little more of a top lip now, but anyway, um, but yeah, like consultation, blase, blase, um, booked my date to get it done. Boom, got it done. Processing. Don't get me wrong. Like I really do love my lips. I really do. I don't regret it. And if y'all want to know how much it was, it was close to $300 um, for what I personally was wanting. Like if you don't want very much, it shouldn't cost you like the 500 and up like it would for somebody that wants like a drastic difference keep that in mind but um yeah like I love them but don't get me wrong like I said I love them I love my lips my lips make me so happy I love looking at them like I they're just so they're very pretty to me um I wish they're a tiny tiny bit bigger um which I'll do the second go around but a lot has just kind of been like going on lately and I honestly just haven't really been like happy like that um like my anxiety has been at a, almost an all-time high um I'm just like I'm, I'm overwhelmed almost as soon as I wake up like it almost kind of makes you wish like dang I want to sleep longer so I don't have to like deal with this feeling you know what I mean um and I, so I got my lips done, to backtrack, sorry. Um, I got my lips done because I'm throwing, like, a photo shoot party event um, for my birthday. My birthday, I'm going to be 25 next Sunday. Um, uh, a bitch is getting older. Ew. Um, yeah. And I really wanted my lips done because I was like 2023. 20, I want to fall more into my ideal self. I want to fall more into, I want to increase my income. I want to, I, this was, this is like my leveling up year after 
honestly not really soaking i've done a lot that since like 2020 the past few couple years um but i still don't didn't really like truly feel accomplished um and i know it's because like my day-to-day -day life goals just weren't really being met like increasing money having money to get this or that or you know what i mean like the the everyday fulfillment wasn't getting there um and it still really isn't here so i kind of reworked my 2023 plan to like okay i want to get this 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 and this done because 25 i'm getting close to 30 so yeah um <clears throat> so yeah like i wanted my lips done before my party um and that was something that was on my list is, list is that i finally wanted to get my lips done after like debating about it for like over a year i know i said six months earlier but now that i think about it it was over a year um so yeah um and because of everything going on it's kind of over it's not even overlapping it's straight swallowing that bitch it's swallowing my happiness with like my procedure and a lot of people would think like oh you got you're getting your lips done you're getting your body done you're blah 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 like you should be so happy and it's like yeah like i'm happy about that but that doesn't overtake like me my happiness about my lips is like this everything else is like this and it's like engulfing it um which I'm not saying that I regret getting my lips done. I definitely don't. I don't. I Like I said, I really do love my lips. No regrets. I would gladly pay it again. I'd even be pay willing to pay a little bit more. Um, Love my lips. But with other issues going on, like don't forget, like if I'm not against getting uh, procedures to be your ideal self. Like you're allowed to look like how you want to look for the most part. You know what I mean? Um... So yeah, but like, don't do it to try to like get rid of like your sadness or, you know what I mean? Because it's not going to engulf like your mental at the end of the day. Like it'll bring, it'll, it sparks joy. <laughs> it does spark the joy, but it's not going to solve your, your, your problems that you got going on. Like it's not going to do that. So I want to just let people know that to keep that in mind that cosmetic procedures and you know like doing stuff like that it's not going to solve your problems i'm not saying don't get it because as you can see i got problems and i got it anyway and i'm very happy with my decision but in my mind i was almost thinking like oh like i'm just gonna be like so happy and blah 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 and that's not the case because my everyday problems is you know why i'm not really happy as of lately like that is overtaking the you know you know what i mean like it's kind of like a big black hole and then that like little cut out of it is like the lips but everything else is like so big you know um i hope i really hope what i'm saying makes sense because also um real quick don't mean to stop the conversation but press ons because at my job i can't have anything extra so i have to keep it simple but i'm just happy i can have nails because i didn't have nails for like almost the first month and i cried every day every day i cried every day i cried okay anyway um also mini side note this ponytail this is synthetic <laughs> why is it giving brazilian hair why is it giving peruvian hair why is it giving my mom is looking at me like why is she sitting at the end of the driveway um hi she didn't see me um why is it giving like it's giving human hair this is why i love synthetic certain synthetic ponies because you don't have to spend the monties for the look um and that's also another thing that okay actually i'll talk about that later but anyway yeah um i hope you guys got like the point of my message um because when it comes to the bigger surgeries i feel like when you are getting a bigger surgery bigger cosmetic procedure bbo um even getting your um titties done is risky like big, the bigger body surgeries just keep in mind it's not going to solve your problems so before i get and if you guys watch my last video about why i'm getting a bbl it's not a bbl it's just a transfer a, <laughs> a fat transfer to the hips um 
I really want to work on me this year. I really want to, you know, and my confidence has been just, just low lately. Like I said, like, I just have not really been happy. Like anxiety at an all time high, like overwhelmed as soon as I wake up. Like it's, it's not been a very fun ride for baby boo over here. Okay. Um, but I really want to make sure that I, that gets corrected before I get the surgery, you know? Um, and regardless of what issues I have around my surgery, they're still going to be there. However, um, if I can, you know, get my self-esteem up a little bit more and start feeling more like myself again before I get that big surgery, then I feel like I will be long-term happier, if that makes sense. Because I value um, yes, of a fleeting, okay, I'm totally quoting Naruto, if y'all watch Naruto, let me know, but a fleeting moment, um, as, uh, of my favorite character, dead as it says, but anyway, um, like, a quick little procedure isn't going to, um, you know, overcome, it's not gonna, like, solve, like, the issues, um, but there's nothing wrong with doing, like, temporarily have things, temporary things that make you happy there's nothing wrong with that at all at all because like I said like this is coming from somebody that just got her lips done wants her hips done you know um I really like the idea of just looking at myself in the mirror and I'm not saying I don't now like don't get me wrong like I think I am a pretty girl um but looking in the mirror and just seeing this person that's like like instead of like level five she's level 40 you know what i mean um like but it's the same person just up 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 up, up a, a, a few levels you know um but yeah anyway i hope that makes sense if it don't i'm sorry i'm sorry i don't know what else to how else to explain it but yeah um i really hope you guys are having a good new year as well um my new year is starting off. Like I said, I haven't been very happy, but good things are, I know they're coming. I'm just very, it doesn't feel like it, but I know that they're coming, you know? Um, but yeah, um, hope you guys are having a good new year. Okay. Um, and I can't wait to start uploading some more videos. I said I was going to really work on like being more consistent with videos this year, even if I don't get a chance to edit them. I still would like them to be up. Um, I'm dead. Not my neighbors pulling in. But yeah, um, with that, that was my sign to go. Oh, well. Not that they hit the house. They literally hit their own house. Okay, anyway. But anyways, um, yeah. So this is a good start to the new year. I hope you guys really like this video. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel. This year, my goal for subscribers, I would at least like to have my first, what? If I'm if I'm gonna go big, 5K. But if I can at least get a thousand subscribers this year, that would be great. Like you guys are gonna have good content. Like I'm, I, I'm hyped. Like I'm hyped to finally have like my little YouTube family. You know, um, cause that's what we is. We's a family. But anyways, um, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe because that's the most important part. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.